we are here with one of the organizers of um is it neighborhood right neighborhood study class we want to just have short interview with her i believe uh you are the head girl right yes. can you introduce yourself to to the viewers yes. hello everyone my name is jenna banyasi a student of this mighty neighborhood study class and also the head girl of the study class yeah, that's very good. Yeah. thank you very much jenna okay Geneva, can you explain to us how you form this um neighborhood study class okay this neighborhood study class was formed or established by there was one lady in our area that one as he as the as the guy saw in mr c he thought mr c was a teacher but mr c is not a teacher he never stood in front of a class and taught or teach yes this study class was established by students bringing their assignments to mr c and mr c also helped us to do our assignment as this continue for the students to bring their assignment there mr c also think that as this the way as it is going mm -hmm. i can try and establish a small study study class whereby they won't pay but as it was going and people were also many he decided to make it a big study class by that by that time the name of the study class was c and sbo study class okay, okay. yes it was organized by two of them mr c and sir omar okay, okay. yes as it continues one of the teachers that is uncle matar decided to ally with us mm -hmm. join with us okay. and that is why we change our name to the neighborhood okay. study okay. class that like the people who are the people who are living around this end right yes okay and also the students outside okay. they also come to that study class okay yes so like it is not only the students in taboko but also in the, uh, near, near, nearby villages right yes we have students from abuko latir kunda Tabokoto and our Faji Kunda here also. Others are coming from Faji Kunda, Bajongkoto, others do most, others near the river. They always sacrifice their lives, life and always attend this study class. Because they always think that this study class is very good. And to be honest, it is very good. Because for me, I started this study class since I was at nursery three. Yeah, that was the time. The study class was established in 2012. Okay, I was about to ask you how long yes. have this study class been been going on? Oh, it was going on since 2012. Oh, yes. Okay. Now coming to this particular kind of fundraising, yeah. I want to know the reason why you decided to organize this fundraising. Okay, we organize this fundraising as a means of help okay. because we settle in there. The area is very congestive. Okay. We can't sit on there as because this time we are in the cold season. It's congested, yes, right? it's okay. congested. Okay. The place is very, very like it is not covered. Okay. It okay. is like this, yes. It's an open place. Yes, it is a, it is an open place. Okay. And we, we did this to ask for help so okay. that we can finish our building and okay. make the place covered. Okay. Yes, so that kids will settle there comfortable, learn, they won't get dirty because there if you go, the legs are always Dirty. So it's like yeah. since you started this particular kind of study class, you have been doing it at a very open place, right? Yes, a very open place. Okay. So you organize this particular kind of fundraising so that it can that you can have a place where you can do it comfortably. Yes. Okay. Yes. This is the reason why we organize this fundraising okay. so that the students outside or the parents outside right. will have access or try to help us okay. by giving donors. You see the ticket we are making, the, way the ticket they bought and entered. We will take that money and try to finish our buildings. Yes. Okay. That is why we organize this fundraising. Okay. Yes. So what are some of the activities that are taking place here? Can you tell us? Poetry, okay. drama, mm -hmm. eating competition, mm -hmm. cultural dances, Nigerian dances, Indian dances, all those kind of, all those activities are about to take place. Oh, yes. you, you, you guys are so innovative. How do you come, with, come up with this idea? Mr. C, the head of the study class, try to help us so that we will have that confidence to speak in public. public. That way he organized this. Yes. I'm sure so a lot of students or young people are watching you right now. Yes. Can you uh, give your final message to them? Okay. My fellow students and my parents also. We, the people of the neighborhood study class, are really appreciating this fundraising we organize. And also, we are also willing 
for other students to come in here and study because this place it always helped especially the grade nines mm -hmm. it always helped the grade because the past batch here mm -hmm. their aggregate were very very good and we were very happy with it because if those people out there if you ask them where do you attend the study class they will always tell you that the neighborhood study class mm -hmm. And you know that that name, if you continue like that, it, it will, that name, oh, I don't, I don't even know how to express my emotion. I'm very, very happy. So you mean they should support you? Yes, they should support me mm -hmm. and come together. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that we can make this study class a very, very good study class. And a study class where the name, it will go higher. Thank then, yeah, so thank you. Thank you so much, head girl. Okay, okay thank yes. you. Um, but you know, I'm head girl, all the time, the same thing. If you left them in the room, I'm going to because the story is like, I'm going to find money to come over. Can you see money? Okay, so the money for more money to come over. Okay. Or even in all of, you know, what whatever love you can speak is okay. Feel free. Okay. But it can be on call. We in the student or maybe neighborhood study class. Left a lot of money. All the money is going to come over. Left a lot of money. All the money is going to come over. All the money is going to come over. Pul memes, memes nak study kelas o bandingnya, biasa am dinaikol basic comfortable ya karang, because mal be muntoh Jesus mian tak baker, especially ni be serious sometimes ni fen dungo do, but we not we don't allow that ni adu nak walau ni fen dungo ni fen tearing o do ni sumia kita nak, itu konsep tu yang lain over, ibu tera jera jera kan ha, and you you ha itu apa lain over siri, ibu siri lagi seperu ke, bading gambian kul, alimul makoi nana study kelas o bang. We really need your finance and. Sally, I start left. Ka ka bill for kapare sign. Ha na start le. Okay, so I'm on complete no. Ha, I'm on complete no. Okay. Ha. So many na left to mark oil la. Ha, left to mark oil. Kapare sign bill na yamin. Kula le karang ha. Ha. Okay. Left to. Wadin jibe la. So niya kan jibe. Ala katale ni ah karam don don mark oil. Ye pare ni karang ola le. Ah, ito karang ke kan damen karam dula ni. Amam 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 bete ha. So ola tin na. I left to ali mark oil pude la so ni alon ko. I will protect them, I will protect them so that they can also do their study class, you know, uh, comfortably. Please keep watching Fine TV, give me your only viewpoint. More people will be interviewed here. So, what do you want to say to you? What do you want to say to you? I want to say to you. I want to say to you. I want to say to you because a lot of parents are here. If you see the way, you don't have the talent to be here. Because here, in your study class, you don't have the talent to be here. Who is public speaking now? Even me as a head girl, I start properly speaking at nursery three. Oh, yes, because Mr. C train skit, Mr. C train train skit, so that they can improve in public speaking. Yes. Can you tell us who you are? Yes, uh, officially I am Adam Obanle, but socially I am Mr. C. Yes. yes. Uh, can you tell us when you organized this or when you established this study class? Uh, the study class started many years back. Because it started since 2011. Yes, with a very, very small number. Yeah. So now we have, we are seeing a very important program here. Very amazing one. Why do you decide to organize this particular kind of program? Yes. You know, like, uh, everybody should have, a, should have a responsibility. You understand? So personal, I think, I think this is my responsibility, right? To help the kids, you understand, that need to be helped. Sometimes helping doesn't mean we have to give somebody money, you understand? But there are many ways in which we can help our kids, right? Looking at the type of society that we are living in, I think the kids need to be helped to build a very, very good foundation for them, you understand? So basically, this is why, you understand, I just initiated this, this study class so that all the kids in the neighborhood can have access to free education. Yes. Yes, I have interviewed with your head girl here. What she told us is that um, you have an open place, so you want to have a place that is very conducive. That's the reason of this um, uh, fundraising. C can you tell us more about that? Please? Yes, like 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 she rightly mentioned, mm -hmm. uh, the place is very exposed, okay. right? Let me just take, take you you know a way back. Okay. Like most of the key studies you're performing, mm -hmm. most of them are university university graduates. Okay. You see, they started studying here since they were in grade two, grade three, right? With the help of the story, at least they were able to do better. This public presentation that they are doing here, right? It was me and then my, my colleagues who helped them understand, at least to be very good public speakers. It started like that. Gradually, as the number increased, right? And then I started bringing in other people who come and help. 
Today, I can tell you we have more than 300 kids that are attending studies here. Right? But if you look at the environment where they are studying, it is too exposed. I've used my own money right, to build, you understand, to, 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 to at least to build a place. But unfortunately, you understand, you know, I could not complete it. The only thing that I can do now is to understand, to organize a fundraising. This is the first time of this kind, to organize a fundraising so that at least we can tap some phone because we've been writing to organizations, to individuals for help. But we, 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 we are not able to get any positive response. But I think this one will help us understand to be seen you understand, beyond, beyond this so that at least somebody out there can, can, can give us a helping hand. I'm not doing this thing for myself only. I'm doing this thing for the kids. Like you can see, you see how they are performing. They are doing very, very well. Right? Everybody's impressed. Right? But we want to go beyond that. In fact, we want to turn it to a new school so that the kids can come uh, in the morning for their normal classes at night because we start classes by 5 to, to, to 10 o'clock at night. You understand? Because uh, we, we set up the classes in a way that at least you know, it is very, very organized. You understand? So like I told you, the purpose of the, the event is to raise funds so that we can com complete our building, right? To change, change it to a nursery school. The nursery school is going to be a very, 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 very strong foundation one. Foundation nursery school. That is going to give, give you know, the stu students you know, a very, 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 very concrete foundation. Right? You know, we have this, we have these private schools that are very, very expensive. Mm -hmm. Most of the parents are now cannot pay for it. Mm -hmm. But now we want to compete those private schools mm -hmm. so that on the sun, uh, and then the kids are not going to pay that much. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. At least that is going to be on the sun. Mm -hmm. Right? Our contribution when it comes to national development. Yes. So what will be your final message to our viewers? Yeah, so to, 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 to anyone viewing us at this very young show at, at, at Fine TV, uh, we are just requesting for help. We are calling for an assistant. You can see the performance of the kids. So the kids that you are seeing here, they are Arabic students. They have never been to English school, right? And then now I can slowly ask you that understand. They are even doing far more better than, than, than those in the English school, English, English school. Sorry, right? And then... You know, as you, this thing is a very good money, money manifesto. Like you can see the parents, you see, you know the response. If, if at all we were not doing something very positive, you think they will come and respond to us? They won't. So, like I said, we need help from individuals, from organizations, from anyone who is willing to support the kids of our community. Not only Faji Kunda, not only Bajong Kudo, kids are coming all the way from Wilengara, from Abuko, from Faji Kunda, right? To, to join our, 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 our study class, definitely. So I think that is what I have to say. Yes. Thank you so much, Mr. Steve. Thank you so much. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, I am Ulema Matubari, the ex uh, head girl of this neighborhood study class. Yeah. So can you also give us some, some of the importance of this neighborhood class? Okay, so I, for one, can be an eyewitness to this. Um, great institute that is the importance or the impact it has on students that is man for example when i came here then when i was in grade seven i wasn't able to stand in public you know to talk about things to educate and to entertain but then when i came in the study class it helped me a lot because i was able to i was able to um discover some of these amazing talents i have in me so yes that is one of the importance and then two uh it also helps to improve the students both in academics and talents. I talked about the talents, so now I am coming to talk about the academics, mm -hmm. right? Sometimes you see in classes, like the teachers do not give you all you need to study. They do not give you all. Like you have assignments, they're just going to give you the assignments and tell you to, you know, like leave it there till tomorrow. But then when you get back tomorrow, they try to forget about it. But then when you have your assignments and you go to the study class and ask your teachers to help you, they are going to help you with whatever they have. And they are very, very good teachers in the uh, study class. They help you with everything everything you need. They help you to explain anything you don't understand from the school. Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. Uh, your head girl told us that, you know, um, the current place that they are learning is an open place. Yes. Um, can you confirm that to us? Yeah, sure. It is really open. Like, it's open. We only have lights there and then the benches and the chairs and blackboards. That is the only thing we have. But then it's an open place. We rent the place. It doesn't have any roof. Like, for example, in the rainy season, sometimes when the rain when the rain is very very heavy, we don't we don't study. We don't study, so that affects us a lot. It affects us a lot. We don't study. We have to wait till when the rain gets better or something, or do, uh, the days that the rain is not uh, raining, then we go back to studies. It's really open. Like it affects us sometimes. So, so for the benefit of our viewers, what do you actually need? Uh, 
and the, uh, the reason why you organize this particular fundraising. Okay, so as the name implies, fundraising, mm -hmm. it's to rain fun, uh, like to raise funds, sorry, mm -hmm. to raise cash, you understand? We need that financial support, we need finances mm -hmm. to make sure that the study class is a better place. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's a little better because we have chairs and blackboards, mm -hmm. but it's, it's not that you know, it's not that conducive for students to learn. As I was saying, we don't have roofs. When it's raining or when the wind is really, really blowing, we don't study. You understand? Because the place is not enclosed. So that is what we need, finance. We really need financial support. That is why we, we organize this fundraising activity here today. Yeah. Then what will be your final message to our viewers? Okay, to you all that are watching us. So I am saying, yes, the study class is really, really good. Since it has been uh, established till date, it has really been doing a lot to the students uh, of the community. They have been helping. Even if you ask some of the parents here, they are going to be saying the same thing. It's really, uh, it's really helping the students. So all we need, if you know that, yes, you can support us financially or whatever way you can support us, we, lean it, we really, really need it. And we are going to appreciate if you do it. Okay. Yes, um, I see your final message, but there's a question that comes to mind. Okay. Uh, see, he told me that yeah. you've been attending this study class here and now you're at the university. Yeah. After finishing the university, are you willing to come back to also give back to your people? Yes, but of course, I've been doing that. Like, even when I finished my Gebeke exams, okay. I came back. I came back to give it back to the students. Okay. I do come when I, am, when I am free to help back. And also, not after that, sir. After when I finish my worst exams too, that is now that I am in the university, you see, you see I am here. Like during lessons at night, I will leave my home and go to the students and help them. I help them like as if I am a teacher, like everybody sees me as a teacher, but it's like I am just an assistant there. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you too. I'm very much saying I like the ex-head girl on New Orleans for an interview, so that's why she was part of this study class and at the Abu Dhabi University. So uh, this is an indication that these guys uh, are doing a lot to help our Ghanaian students. But please, I'll not try to make you know, a little bit of a little bit of a little bit No amount is, um, is little. If you want to make you a little bit of 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 a